Hey, Visanta here, and in this video, I'm going to show you how I roll for high turner prices without any hacks or third party things. But all you need is a switch and your willingness to time travel. So let's get to it! But yeah, since the Pokemon DLC is coming out soon, I'm probably going to be busy with that. So maybe um, one of you guys can do this and help out the community. So there is a caveat is that you can't actually have turnips so you can't actually make money yourself but you can help out your friends your community you can just host these yourself right and then you can charge them tips or fee and that's how i make money kind of and look mile tickets by doing this and just you know giving back and then they'll feel nice enough to give you a donation or tip but let's just get started so first thing you want to do is Wednesday is usually the highest probability of getting a high turn up rate. So what you want to do is go to your system settings, right? And then you go daytime, make sure you're on a Wednesday. That's my future right now. And go, you usually want to restart the game, but I'm already on Wednesday. So that should be okay. Yeah, I'm already on Wednesday. You can like just stand still. See that time on the bottom left of the screen screen and then you can go in here this is how you set up right go into your store look cranny and then timmy and tommy's gonna have this chat box that pops up so you want to just get this started you can check the price right now if you want you don't have to but usually i would just save here because every time you come in you at least skip that part it won't have a pop-up that stops you momentarily from moving Right, so you would have to save and then you can go back in time, like just a few minutes or a few hours, depending on what you want to do. I usually like to start between two and three, so I can kind of maximize the time that I'm getting um, turnips with high prices for people coming in and out. So well, after that save, I usually just close the game. Press X to close the game, by the way. Go system settings, wait time. Go to 240 something that's usually depends on up to you but you want to be above noon because once you hit hit noon right but if you go before noon and then you hit noon again it's gonna reset the turn up prices so we're gonna load the game up that will technically load up within the current time and then you'll see why later but you do not actually have to save now of course the game takes forever to load right all right we're in now we just go straight to the store my island loads Anyway, how's your days, guys? <laughs> All right, it's finally loaded. Post in the comments down below. I'm gonna go into Nook's Cranny. And you notice now, right, that there's no more pop up. And then you just talk to them. And then you click turn their prices. 197, not bad. But usually when I do this, I wanna aim for 400 plus. So you exit, close the game. You don't actually have to gotta skip a date anymore. And you notice how you're going back in time, right? Every time you go back in time, your turnips get rotten. So you cannot do this with any turnips. You just go back a few minutes. If you go back one minute, you load the game. Um, by the time everything loads and you find out your price, probably two minutes has passed already. So you have to make sure you go back in time before the time you actually load so let's say right now right i'm loading up like 242 so next time i load up the game it has to be before 242 no matter what it is it's before 242 so when it loads the game at this part it will actually check the time and like oh the time is before the last time it played like there's some cash or something and then it'll re-roll the turner price be completely new not dependent on anything it could even it can go down to like the lowest range to like twenty, or it can go high as you know six hundred or something, right? All right, so here we go. Go back in the store. And 
we're just gonna go talk to Timmy or Tommy again. And you notice that the prices are different. The 197 is 192 now, right? So you keep doing this, right? You just keep closing. You just keep re-rolling. You keep doing this until you get that um, price that you really want. Set your own range, your own criteria, of what price to stop on. And yeah, just have fun and start hosting your turn up party parties like I do on stream. Uh, Friday evenings, Saturday evenings, and Sunday mornings. I usually do this on my Twitch stream. So check out my socials down below. And hopefully you guys get on that because I'm going to be playing Pokemon Sword and Shield mostly pretty soon. So yeah, later days.